today is going to be my day one of my daily vlogs that I'm going to do here. And basically I'm just going to take you on a day of my life. So it is Wednesday morning at the morning, at the moment. We're just having some breakfast. Um, I'm actually doing the keto diet. I've done the keto diet before. Before I got pregnant, I lost 30 pounds. And then I had my baby, I got pregnant, and then I just kind of like fell off the bandwagon. So I am trying to do it again and lose a little bit of weight for the summer and just feel better. I just feel better when I eat less sugar and carbs. So there's that. And I wish I would have filmed yesterday, but you know, there was just a lot going on yesterday and it was just too much. So... I'm going to show you in today's vlog what I did yesterday and what I did yesterday, uh, what I got yesterday. So what I did was I, I went to a, a greenhouse, it's called Our Farm Greenhouse. It's about an hour away from me if you are in Manitoba. It's in Portage La Prairie, uh, just outside of Portage La Prairie. And I'm going to show you just like what I kind of got. And I got like a bunch of plants, I spent a little bit too much mo money. and. This is my keto lunch today. It's a portobello mushroom, and then I mixed like cream cheese, cheddar cheese, jalapenos, and bacon together, and then I topped with a little bit more bacon, but isn't that delicious? Super keto and super yum. So we're outside, and in the winter, I blew this little tub up for Heidi, and I put it in the basement and put her toys in it when she was younger. She like hated it, but now this is the first time. Are you excited? <laughs> this is the first time I'm putting it outside filling it up with water she's gonna have so much fun yeah she's a little undecided one of our friends had this a couple days ago and we visited them and she had like the time of her life leave it alone Heidi look your slide so yeah this will be fun little yeah this will be super fun. Like, how cute is this outfit, too? It's like a little sailor. Yay! In and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. Mama's sipping on her ah! iced coffee. I always use, we have a coffee pot, so I always use the leftover coffee, and I make myself an iced coffee. This is my cute cup, Starbucks cup that I got when I went to Arizona. Wishing it feels like Arizona right now, so it's wonderful. I'm just sipping on my coffee, and little Miss Shark is just playing. I think the pool's almost done and filling up. Heidi, are you are you gonna go down the slide? Are you gonna go down the slide? It's such a beautiful day today. It's gonna be like 25 Celsius, and I can't wait. We're supposed to get a lot of rain this weekend, so I'm trying to get in as much sun time as we can and until we're locked up in our home. <laughs> but that's okay. I'll uh, take you guys on a quick little tour of my outdoor plants, maybe in a little bit. Or I'll show you what I got yesterday from our farm greenhouse. I hope you're able to see this with the sun out here, but this is one of the bigger ones that I got yesterday. So I have this plant inside. I just can't remember what it's called. If you want to tell me, I hope you can see because I can barely see. But it's so gorgeous. It reminds me of a tiger. Like how pretty. It's really hard to get the water spots off. I tried um, cleaning it a bit. If anyone has any suggestions, definitely let me know in the comments below. But like, that's it in all its glory. And I can't wait to propagate. I'm just going to like cut off some little pieces here and try propagating them. Really pretty, like it also has like, I think I have a thing for purple underneath the leaves. A lot of like calatheas and my inch plants. So, so pretty. And then the other bigger one I got was this one. It's my philodendron hope. I've been wanting this for so long. How pretty. It's pretty big. I still have to plant it in this big pot. I don't have any soil, I gotta go do that. And I've wanted this for so long and I'm so happy that I finally have one in my life. Like these leaves are like pretty big. Oh, I'm so excited. Super pretty. And as far as I know, like it's an easy plant to take care of. And you guys, stop it. Look at how freaking cute. Ugh, I can't. So, very excited about that. 
This is kind of my begonia corner. Um, these two are new, so this is, again, I need to like wipe down the leaves. I tried, but this is a red, uh, what is this one? A red bull, red bull begonia. And this guy is a berry swirl, like stop, how gorgeous. It's like a reddish minty green iridescent. And like, I don't know where you live, but like these begonias here are so cheap. This is like $4. <laughs> and like, this is my first begonia ever, my Rex begonia. And, oh my goodness. <laughs> There's my Rex. I think it's a type of inch plant or a peperomia. Again, look at the beautiful um, purple leaves. My friend, Amanda, she gave me a little propagation of this and I'm like, I need more, like, I can't wait. So I needed two more things to hang on my um, pergola. So I got two of these guys for $20 and I think they're pretty lush, so there's that one and then the other one's just way over there. So I'm in um, Dollarama right now and I'm just trying to look for like some pots. I need to pot up my cactuses. I got like the cutest little cute ceramic um, pots. I only bought two of them and I kicked myself in the butt because I wish I bought more, but these ones are super cute. These ones are $4. So I think I'm gonna get two gray, two white, and that like minty green. And then we have actually like this exact color in our living room. So like the red and the purple. So I'm gonna get four of those. And I'm unsure if I should get these ones. So they're ceramic and they would fit the majority of my cactuses, I think, but like, I feel like David's not gonna really like them, so I'm not sure. Just bought this. Or 